three, two, one, time! We know we have a lot of new folks in the audience right now. This is called the autonomous period. Robots are looking to move towards or over the outer works, these defenses here. And you see that we've had robots go across and some robots stop at that. This results in some scores. Bert managed to score a goal, a boulder into the castle and the high goal, putting the Blue Alliance up 32 to 22. Now we move into what's known as the teleoperated period where teams are looking to weaken the outer works of their opponent. Right now, Horror is working on the rough terrain. They have now damaged the rough terrain. Delta Prime has just shot themselves over the Cheval de Freeze, and there's a high goal shot by Burt into the castle. Tech Storm is hung up in the moat. We'll see if they can get some help from an Alliance partner to get them out of the moat. And Burt with another nothing but net performance with that high goal shooter. So accurate during this tournament. Heading up over, uh, over the defenses. Now we see some help. Beverly Panthers pushing their Alliance partner over to get the weakening of the moat. Let's see if they go back to the moat one more time. Bert looking at another high goal shot, and you'll notice over here the castle, the red castle, the, tie, the flag has just come down. That means that they have damaged that tower. This puts the blue alliance in the position to be able to potentially capture that tower at the end of this match. Red alliance working on the outer works defenses. If four of the five Outer Works defenses are damaged during the match, this leads to what's known as a rank point for that alliance. And rank points are important as they help to determine the position of each team at the end of the competition. Burt looking to climb, looking to scale that castle. They've got their hook up, but it looks like it missed. Nonetheless, they've got three robots up on the batter right now. Let's see in the last three seconds, if Tech Storm can get up on the batter, it looks like they might stay there, and that's going to be good for the Red Alliance. Three challenges, Red Alliance, and a capture perhaps for the Blue Alliance. Our referees will tell us the final results.